sort of leader of the Finnish Mafia, Miro Haskinen, really took his offensive game into the stratosphere. Game winner from Haskinen. He makes everybody on the ice with him better. Banks it, Haskinen, Robertson, one-timer, score! Every single shift, he mops up many errors of others with his defensive game that looks so easy and breezy, and his ability to just distribute the puck, put people in a good spot because of it, is as good as any in the league. My name is Eero Mandula. I'm a co-founder and um, skills concept creator in Vima Hockey. I've been coaching Miro for five or six years now. In the summertime, I'm part of the coaching staff, actually coaching him on the ice, off the ice. My role is to figure out what are the skills and what kind of training will make him better. After the season, season ends, uh, recharge a little bit, seeing family, seeing friends. After three to four weeks, I, I start practicing again, doing off-ice stuff, workouts, uh, then ice practice. We have done this with the same coaches for six years now about, so we know each other well and we know what I need. I know that I have to be better every year and trying, trying to do that. There might be some players that work even more in time. There are not too many players that work as well during that time. A lot of the players that you know take their development as high as Miro has taken, it's uh, something that you need to have. One example that we've been focusing on is shooting. Where to shoot the pucks, when to shoot the pucks. Talking with the goalies too, like what kind of ways what the Ds do on the blue, for example, makes it hard for the goalies. Now he started to shoot a little bit higher and now the tips gets more effective. I think feed system is a little more, more active and defensemen are, are really included. Play a little more with the puck and have a little more, more poise with it. I think there's, there's that kind of poise, calmness in his game. No nonsense, trying to get better every day. There is a good uh, competitor there. Of course, I know that role has changed a little bit, but I'm, I'm still the same guy and focused to play my game and that's the that's the thing, every time I step on the ice, I try to give my best and help the team as, as much as I can. You can see that determination. He has an idea behind his training. Like every day when he works, there is a reason. Like he understands why this thing is making me better, why it's getting me closer to that goal. It's not that you work hardest, but you work the smartest. He's on his best when he's a uh, tough situation, when, when the team is down. He wants to be on ice when, when the game will be tie or, or something like that. He wants to win. That's what the Stars have waited on Miro Heitzkanen that ends games for them. I just want to be better every year. That's my expectations. I wanted to be a lot better what I was the year before, so I try to not take any pressure about it. I know that I have to be the guy and be the be the leader. There is so many different approaches to who is the best D. For me, I think it's the overall way of how you play. You're a defender, so your job is to defend. Miro Haskin has been involved in a, a ton of good in the game here again tonight. He's so good defensively. Now he's getting better and better offensively too. Yeah, right now I think I'm one of the best defensemen in the NHL. I still have room to improve and be better, but right now I think I'm, I'm pretty close there. Like what's really inspiring for me is that when you see a player as good as he is, for example, and you see there is still so much that he can be better, then you think like, how good can this guy be? And he's not only gonna get better, he has so many good years to come that he will improve, and the, uh, the best years are not even here yet, even close.